First Nations people and all segments of society by reaching out uh, to social movements. I've been going uh, to the I Don't Know More rallies, for example, and we need to engage uh, the women's movement and other groups uh, in a very uh, similar way. Now, I have put forward a policy position on representative democracy that includes some very concrete changes to party processes that would allow us to nominate more uh, women and First Nations candidates. Our party already has a Bessie Ellis Fund to provide financial support to women seeking NDP nominations. The problem is donations to that fund aren't eligible for a tax credit. But we could very easily have provincial office take the money, issue a tax receipt, and turn it over to the Bessie Ellis Fund. This would greatly increase financial support to women seeking NDP nominations. Second of all, we can learn a lesson from the federal party, which doesn't hold nomination meetings until there's a member of an equity-seeking group, a woman or an aboriginal person or a visible minority seeking the nomination. We should do the same thing provincially. Last but not least, we need a provincial organizer who part of their mandate is to seek out women candidates. Thanks.